The term absorbed dose refers the amount of energy absorbed per unit mass of substance. The unit of absorbed dose is rad. This unit is independent of type of radiation and the medium. The SI unit of absorbed dose is gray. The unit rad is related to gray as 1 g equals 100 rads. Absorbed dose is a quantity applicable to both indirectly and directly ionizing radiations. In case of indirectly ionizing radiation, the energy is imparted to matter in a two-step process. In the first step resulting in coma means the indirectly ionizing radiation like X-ray or gamma radiation. When these radiation passing through the medium first transfers their energy as kinetic energy to secondary charged particles. In the second step, these secondary charged particles further travel in medium and loses their major part of kinetic energy. And this loss of kinetic energy is equal to the amount of absorbed dose in transverse medium. In case of directly ionizing radiation, charged particles like electron beam or proton beam, when passing through the medium, they slow down and loses their kinetic energy, so that a major part of their kinetic energy directly transferred to the medium. In this case, loss of kinetic energy is equal to the amount of energy absorbed in the transverse medium. Equivalent dose we know that the biological effects of radiation depend not only on absorbed dose, but also on the type of radiation. When we expose the same person with different types of radiation, the effect of radiation is different for different radiation. It depends on which type of radiation is used. For example, in case of alpha particle give 20 times more effect as compared to photon or electron beam. Hence, the ICRP report 26 introduced the dosimetric quantity equivalent dose. It is the absorbed dose averaged over a tissue or organ and weighted for the radiation quality. It is given as this formula absorbed dose multiply with radiation weighing factor where WR is the weighing factor for the radiation type and it is analogous to RBE in radiobiology. SI unit of equivalent dose is CW and special unit of equivalent dose is REM and 1 CW is equal to 100 REM and in practice milli CW unit of equivalent dose is used. This table give the value of radiation weighing factor for different radiation. These are the revised values of radiation weighing factor for different radiation in ICRP 103 publication. The whole body exposures are not uniform, and dose equivalents for various tissues may differ markedly. Hence, the radiation induced effects vary with the sensitivity of the organ. When we expose the person with radiation, there is a difference in sensitivity among organ. Some organs are more sensitive, and some are less sensitive. That's why whole body exposure are not uniform. To account these non-uniform irradiation and organ sensitivity variation, the ICRP26 introduced the term effective dose, which describes the dose to the whole body, and is derived from equivalent dose. It is defined as Equivalent dose multiply with tissue weighing factor, where WT is the weighing factor for the tissue. HT is the mean. Equivalent dose received by the tissue. And A is the summed organ or tissue doses as an overall whole body dose. Some important points about effective dose. Effective dose is used to evaluate the probability of stochastic effects at low doses. Organ of high sensitivity carries a higher risk for a given dose. The sum of the weighting factors is unity. The unit of effective dose is sievert.
The table gives the value of tissue weighing factors for various tissues as per ICRP 60 and revised ICRP 2005. The table gives the revised value of tissue weighing factors for various tissues as per ICRP 103.